Hello everybody. Welcome to the first of the monthly premieres by Skeleton Siske. Over an hour of highlights from live streams, unreleased material and lots of extra tasty extra content. Including some behind the scenes commentary. If you enjoy this please be holding for a thumbs up and maybe even subscribing. Now let's start the show. I've I didn't my, get you. Well, I got my computer. It, it switched on here. I got my uh, Firefox and uh, recycle bin. So you use Firefox browser? Uh, yeah, what is I the make and my... model of this computer? Is this uh, a Windows or a Apple? Oh, it, it's a window. Okay. Which browser do you use? Uh, Firefox. Open it and in Firefox at the very top in the address bar, yeah. you have to type in over there www. Dot the, yeah, okay. Support S U P P O R T support support dot dot. Me, M as in Mike, E as in Edward, M E me. Me. Okay. Now hit the enter key. Uh, it says support connection, enter a six digit code. Click on yes. I did. It's got application running as Windows System Service. Now you are securely getting connected to the Apple server with me, Technician Lee. You would be having an option over there to click on OK. okay. Please click on OK. Okay. Now Michael over here, we are going to first check with the security part of your devices. With the help of this computer, I would be able to check it on each of your devices which is connected with the same network one by one. Okay. First, I'm going to check with the security part as I said you whether your security is working fine or not. Okay. Okay. Here it goes. Securities. Let it get open. All right. See the spyware unwanted software protection is not updated yet. Okay. Okay. Find it. See, virus protection not found. Out of date spyware unwanted software protection. Network uh -huh. access protection is off. The security part of your device is in a bad shape. They are not working properly over here. You can see it. Okay. Well, I, I never actually use the computer. I'm on my iPhone all the time. Okay. Only have, only but Michael, I'm not talking as, just as about as this computer. It is same thing on your iPhone as well. Oh, that comes up on my iPhone? Yes, with all of you. Because it's not just I'm running a scan on this computer. I'm running a scan on all of your devices, which are connected with the same network. Ah, so Let me show you again network. over here. Yeah. Let me show you again over here. Okay. With the help of your network, I'm running a scan on each of your devices which you use it. Let it get run. It will give us the status of the security part. Now it is running, you can see. Oh yeah, it's got all, all that right in. It will give us a status of the security part. Let it get complete. Okay.
It's taking a long time. Yeah, it, it's, a, it's a lot of stuff. Um, it's you can not see the result. Nice internal, external, operational bat file. This security not working. Security is not recognized as an internal or external. Fire firewall not updated. No, oh there. Well, like I said, I never that means use the security this part is not working. I normally working. have it on, on, my, on my iPhone. Yes, sir, just give me a quick moment, okay? Just give me okay. a quick moment. So, the security parts are not working fine because such of the securities are not updated yet. Firewall is not updated security is not working even we have saw that the virus protections are also not updated network access protection is turned off let me help you out in this way you would be able to understand it much more oh, okay see when any device get manufactured at that time sort of securities get installed into that device and those securities are called inbuilt securities in this inbuilt security, the security which comes, that is network, firewall, security, and network, access, protection. Every device have it, whether it would be Apple, Windows, Android, any device, they do have all these devices, have this security. And it got installed into the device when the device get manufactured according to the compatibility mode of that particular device which you also have it on your device but unfortunately what happened this security needs to get update according to the time period but maybe by mistake and it never got updated by you okay um, oh, okay okay on any devices it never got updated and to update this, you get some notification on Apple devices at this corner. You get some notification and on Windows devices at this corner. Even you are getting a Windows update over here on the Windows device. See, the Windows license is expired. Oh, it's yeah. built 7601, I, Windows 7. You can before. see this copy of Windows is not genuine. So you need to get it done, but you didn't got it done. Now, how it shows you update in this way, no, no notifications. Update the operating system, update the software part, update the security part. You also got an update with the security part, but by mistake you didn't acknowledge it. So it got skipped from there. And when it got skipped, the security part left old version. And whatever infections were sitting in your network part, they got an easy access to get into your device because the security was a weak security. They were not updated. So immediately what happened, hackers also got a, ch this security got them damaged and hackers got a chance to get into your device easily. So along with this infection, that means viruses, hackers also got into your device. So this is what running wrong over here. So we Apple, what we are going to do for you best over here, we are going to restart all securities. You already have it. We just need to get it restart. Ah, right. And then that'll, okay. that'll work on my phone. My iPhone. Yes, yes. On each of your device, you no need to worry, okay? okay? I'm taking care of all of your devices. And once it will get restart, I'm going to update all securities. Okay? Okay. So you would be having a safe and secure latest version securities on each of your device and also what I'm going to do best for you I am going to I'm going to put all the securities on auto updated mode 
so in future whenever there would be any update regarding the security part it would get update on your device automatically oh, oh okay so automatic like yes just the security yeah. part okay okay yeah so it would get automatically updated on your device all right okay that and sir, can you just give, can you just give me a quick moment? Okay. Just give me a quick moment. Don't mind my silence, okay? Okay. All right. So, Michael, what I said you, you already have all the inbuilt security, but just due to some mistake, it never got update on your device. I'm not blaming you at all because I do understand that you are not a technical person, that you should be aware of all those things. So, better, what we are going to do right now? Whatever happened wrong with the security part, we will make them in a good shape. And also for future security, I am going to put all the securities on an auto updated mode. So whenever there would be any update related to the security part, it will get automatically done on each of your devices. Either it would be your iPhone, iPad, tablet, Kindle, this computer or any another computer. All of the devices will get safe and secure directly through the network okay 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 all right you know what happens if your one device is compromised so your rest of the devices also get compromised you share the same network and the IP address on each of your devices that's why so through that IP address through that network I would be able to secure all of your devices and able to remove all the hackers and viruses okay uh, so, so my my iPhone is connected to the computer. Yes, that is uh, not physically. It is connected. It is directly connected with the IP address. Let me tell you what it is exactly. IP address. IP address means Internet Protocol address. IP stands for Internet Protocol. And your IP address is one nine eight dot one six two dot. 0.0.1 this is your IP address and this number Michael you are registered in this cyber world okay ah, you are registered okay. in this cyber world with the help of this number and in this cyber world when your one device is working and in future if you'll purchase any another device or if you have more than one device so all these devices will get connect one by one with this IP address whatever devices you have like I have mentioned it over here one of one one of one like if you have one computer this Windows it's a laptop or a desktop uh, well, th this is a, um, a desktop just to make just to not get confused I'm making apart from this do you have any another computer Oh, this is the only one uh, no I just have this and my uh, my, my iPhone. iPhone apart from this you don't have any another device this is the only devices which you have two devices are there only this uh, computer and iPhone yeah I, I mean I don't I don't know don't think I have anything else like uh, do you have any thing. tablet do you have any tablet Kindle iPad, any uh, smart television which is connected to internet. Oh, I, I have the television that connects up on uh, what is it? Spotify, YouTube, has all that stuff. Oh, that is a smart. So that is also involved in this. Ah. That is called a smart television which runs on the basis of that. That is also hacked right now. So this phone, this computer, and this television, we are going to fix it. So this is the all three devices which you have? Uh, yeah, uh, I I don't know anything else that connects up on on the uh, on the internet. Okay, so see these three devices I'm going to secure right now right away, which is connected with the same IP address, and also with the same IP address and network part. So I'm going to secure all of this thing. Okay. Okay. 
and how we are going to secure it I found the one mistake over here that is called a root cause that is your securities are not working so I'm going to make them in a working status and auto updated mode so it would be safe and secure okay okay so this is what one thing I have checked now I'm going to check with few more things over here I have just mentioned about this devices so that I won't get confused while working on it Michael okay okay now Michael all the securities are there but they are weak security they are old version because they are not updated and the viruses which got into your device they got a chance to damage that security and that viruses are called infections so I'm going to check with the level of this infection how many are there okay okay and also at the same time I will educate you as well here we goes okay okay <clears throat> Can you see this? How many infections are there? Uh, yeah, it says 116 events. Yes, that means the infections. The event, number of events. Uh, number of infections. 116 is too much, Michael. You know? And all these infections are showing us in the form of errors and warnings over here. You can see. Oh, Some okay. of them are on a critical stage. Oh, yeah. Some of them are critical. This all are the infections who got into your device and got damaged with the security part. And all these infections, how they get into your device? When you are on internet. Okay? Yeah. When you are on internet. Did you, re did you shut down your computer? No, I thought you did that. No, how I would be able to shut down your computer? Well, I didn't do From it. mind, no. No. It is restarting, wait. Let it get restart. Don't do anything with the computer, okay? Okay. Maybe the hackers know that you are connected with Apple and we are securing it. So they tried to do something wrong over there immediately. Oh, it's the hackers. But they it? don't know that you are... You got... Yeah, but they don't know that you securely got connected already to the Apple server. They won't be able to do anything wrong right now. But yes, if you'll get disconnected from this session, they would be able to do anything wrong. So when you are connected to this session, I need to get it safe and secure. I need to fix your devices. Then it okay. would be safe and secure all the time. Yeah. Now tell me one thing, your computer is restarting now? Uh, is yeah, it rebooting it now? Yeah, it says start in Windows. Okay, let it get start. Yeah. Let me know whatever it would be showing you over there immediately, okay? Okay. Well, it's, it just says start in Windows and Michael, it got the logo. Okay. And Michael, you no need to worry about anything. You are with Apple. It's our responsibility to make each and everything safe and secure over there. Along with your iPhone and television as well. Okay. Okay? Yeah. All right, so let it get restart first. See, in the meanwhile, it was 116. Now it went on 119. Oh, yeah. Three infections got into it immediately. You can well, see that, now that how these hackers are trying to get it. So see, now the results are at front of you that how badly your device and accounts are hacked. Okay, okay. Um... In a, in a friction in a friction of second hackers can do anything wrong and how all these infections get into your device I'll tell you when you are on internet you are on your browser you visit any website download any stuff watch any videos and movies yeah I, I watch videos on, on you, you know um, the uh, adult give content, me a quick moment yeah, just give me a quick moment. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm sorry, Michael. I was talking to my backhand team technician. Uh, you there, Michael? About the hackers? Sorry? Uh, d does your backhand know about um the hackers? I'm um, I'm powder and my phone. Yeah. Michael, at the time when I'm checking with your devices over here at front of you, at the same time, my backhand team is also checking with this hacking attempt from their end at the backhand. Uh, so they would be able to find out the exact hacker which is running inside your device and accounts. Even if they once they would find it out, I would be able to show you over here. They are doing okay. their job over there, okay? Yeah. Does this take a long time to do with, with your back end? Hello? Yeah, hello, Michael. I'm back. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I was just wondering how long does it take for, for you to do your back end stuff? They're checking it there and they would be able to get it in <laughs> from there. We are just checking it front end with you so that we would okay. be able to know the exact things. So, Michael, uh, uh, tell me one thing. You are the only primary user of all these devices? Uh, yeah. What do you do on these devices? What is in basic use of these devices? Well, I, I don't often use this, uh, this one. I'm normally on my iPhone. That's where I watch all my videos and I buy the stuff on eBay, Amazon, the I store. I check my emails. Yes, Michael. Yeah. Yeah. So what he was telling me? Oh, yeah, what is the basic I, use of this I, computer? I, I use I use my iPhone all the time for uh, uh, buying the email, uh, the eBay thing, and uh, you're trying to siski me, your grandchild. Oh. That was good. Should we start the next clip? Um, I think it's more or less time for us to hit some commercials. What do you think? Okay, let's go to the commercials. Do you like to hear real scamming rundies? Yeah, to see Changa. Punjabi Munda, to Punjabi. Call now to hear to hot run these as they tease scamming two tears. Tiri Maki post to Tmariki Rundi. And keep hand keep all the reto. Hey, Kutu Kutni at Pedrico. Dial upon four one nine seven D three four one nine seven eleven D seven. These Rundis wait on two things. Taxi drivers and your phone call. Sasriya call ji. Are kaha ka taxi driver hai tu? Hey? Call now to enjoy the red hot baiting rundis. Calls charged at 2000 rupees per minute. New from Rundi Records. 22 exciting hits. Legalize Maruwa Including IRS scammers Mega People call So call ooh, ooh, ooh. CRA scammers I need I woman no cry Tech support scammers Mama sa sa Zen zan zan Took a dream Yes, they're all here yeah, on this see. fine album. Hello from the Only other side. Hello from the other side. Available on cassette and compact disc. Order now. Everybody who knows she might go. Everybody wanna take a ride This spectacular offer cannot be seen in shops girl. You have to order now Find out the one that she belongs to me We 
we only accept iTunes gift cards and Steam gift cards. You can get them from your local Walmart, Target, or many more. Don't be a fan, Chode. Order now! Hello, Q. How are you today? I'm doing I am just right, waiting thanks. on the taxi driver, if you know what I mean. Ah, the old taxi driver. Let's get into the next call, shall we? Thank you for calling support. You're speaking with Benjamin. How may I help you? Uh, yes, I got a, um, a thing on my computer. It, it's, it says to call up. I really apologize for the same. May I know what is the problem which you are facing, sir? Well, it, it, it was a message that popped up on my computer. It's on the internet. What is the message? What is the message, sir? Can you please uh, read it out for me? Uh, yes, it mentions about um, uh, some kind of um, uh -huh. network security, I think. Uh, some kind Can you of read virus. it out for me, please? Um, is this a number 268D3? Uh -huh. Okay, that yes, is the uh, error code which you're talking about. Oh, that one. Uh, well, um, it, it won't let me use my, my, my internet. Okay, not a problem. Let me just check that out for you. Give me one minute, okay? Okay. And may I have your name, sir? Uh, yes, it's uh, Jonathan Thomas. Okay. And are you the only person who's using this lab computer? Is, a, is it home computer, office computer, uh, what? Uh, yes, it's my home computer, yes. So this is uh, an infection which has been downloaded from the internet into your computer and the alert which you have received is from your Windows Security Center. Every Microsoft computer has a Windows Security Center which sends you the alert in case there is any kind of a problem. Uh, okay. Okay. So may I know what is the basic use of this computer? What do you use this computer for? Oh, well, I uh, check my emails um, and uh, uh, shop on, on the Amazon and eBay and, uh, and uh, watch some uh, okay. videos, if you know what I mean. The reason, the reason why I'm asking you this is because this is an infection. It can be basically going, it basically is used to gain access to the computer or to monitor the information whatever you use over the internet and that is the reason somebody tried to gain access to your computer from a remote location oh dear. and that is why your computer sent you the alert oh, okay so um, it's some kind of um, a security hack thing I don't know what a hack is yes absolutely correct so, do you have any kind of a protection or a security to stop these kind of problems, sir? Um, I I don't know. I I okay. I, have I will help you out with a few steps. Have antivirus, sir. Uh, uh, is that it? This is not a no. That is this is not a virus-related issue, sir. Virus uh. is something different. Infection is something different. Virus can be easily removed if you have any kind of an antivirus. That will go ahead and remove that for you. Oh, but this uh, is not a virus. It's not. So what I would do is I'll help you out with few steps. Uh, please check the computer and we'll see what we can do. In case if we find no security in the computer, I will recommend you few securities which you can buy. So I cannot sell you the security, but yes, I can recommend you a few companies from where you can get one. Okay, well, uh, my, my computer is just... Uh We've got a blue thing. No problem. Uh, it, 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 you say it's, it's a laptop it's or a computer? Restarting. It's restarting. Is it a laptop computer. or a computer? Uh, yes, it, it's it's on my desk. No, is it a desktop or a laptop? That's uh, what yes. I'm asking you. Yes, I, I have it on my desk. Desktop. And okay, the keyboard you have a window key. I hope you can see that. Uh, yes, uh, Windows. Okay. Yeah. Press and hold it down. It's still rebooting. Sure. Do you see the Microsoft window key in the keyboard? Uh, yes, it's uh, down the bottom on the left. Yeah. Press it. Press and hold it down. 
Okay. Yes, we will stop. And while you press and hold it down, press the letter R, R as in Romeo. R. Okay. Now what do you see in the... R. Now, now what do you see? Windows. It will start, documents, programs. You did it wrong, Jonathan. Let me explain that to you again. You need to first press and hold down the window key. Press and hold it down. Yes. And while you're holding down the window key, press the letter R. R. Yeah. Oh, a little box. Now, do you um, see a box? Yeah, it says type the name of um, a program folder, document, and internet. A uh, windows are open. There you need to type W. W W W W so so like a porn site dot dot help me one word that's help me help me H E L P M E help yes. me M E me help all me, one yes. word mm -hmm. dot dot Net, N E T, N as in Nancy, E as in Echo, okay. T as in Texas. Yes, so it says www help me uh, dot net. Dot net. Yeah, now click on OK. Okay. Okay, it says um, establish support connection. So type the name. Type in your name in the first box. Okay. Yes. The next box, type a support key. You okay. can write down the support key which I would be providing you. Oh, uh, you're, okay. you're going to give me the key. Right, that is 193. 193. 063. 063. 281. Okay. Now click on continue. Um, Did you click on continue? It says a uh, uh, click go to assist opener to begin. Right, click on okay. go to opener to begin. Click on that. Uh, do I want to run uh, this file? Log me. Click in. on run. Run. Click on run. Okay. Uh, go to opener encountered an error. The timestamp signature mm. and or certificate could not be verified. Was a uh, malformed. Mm. Uh, failed to download from the servers. Mm. Uh, please restart mm. the download or, or contact Click the on global restart support. Download. Is that you? Are, you? are you the global customer support? Yes. Ah. Uh, Okay, it says show log file or close. Close this box and go back to the screen where it says click run to start. Do you see that? Uh, it says unable to start your session then it says try again in a big button. Click on try again. Okay. Now what do you see? Um, it says connecting go to assist downloading uh, oh it's got the error the error is back okay no problem on the very top where did you type the website name where it says HTTPS uh, yes click on that erase everything out of there oh, okay now type www uh, yes Dot. Dot. Ultra. U L T R A. Ultra. Ultra. Viewer. V I E W E R. Viewer. The viewer. Dot. Dot. Net. N E T. N as in Nancy. E as in Echo. He is in Texas. 
net. Okay. Now hit enter. It's got uh, Ultra Viewer Remote Control Support Software. Now, right below that, you see a green box which says download. Uh, yes. You, uh, click on that. Click here. on download. Okay. Yeah, click on that. Okay. Do, 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 do you want me to open it up? It's downloaded. Mm -hmm. Open that which has been downloaded. Open it up. Okay. It says the publisher could not be verified. Are you sure you want to run the software? Click, click, click on run. Okay. Uh, you're a control. Um, do you want to allow the following to make the changes click on? Click on yes. Okay. It's got a. Uh, setup will install Ultra Viewer into the Click following. on Click on next Next uh, What, keep on clicking on next I guess? Yes Okay Till the time you get an option which says install Please clicking on Please click on next Okay uh, Launch Ultra Viewer finish uh -huh. Click on finish Okay now, do you see a box which will open up eventually? Oh, yes, it's got um, allow remote control. Uh, control remote Do you have a number, ID, and a password? Can you please provide me the ID and the password? Uh, partner ID, password, custom password, connect to partner. No, it's your ID. You have an option that says your ID. Okay, we are successfully connected. You can see your mouse cursor are moving. Oh, yes. Let me just firstly connect you to me so that I can help you out. Okay. Thank you. So how was your day so far, sir? Oh, well, well, it was okay uh, earlier on, but um, a bit concerned about this uh, uh, computer. Not an issue, issue, sir. I will double check what is the problem. Okay. And if I find anything which is required, I'll let you know right away. Okay. Uh, okay. Most probably you do not have a security. You might require a security. Okay. I will recommend you something which is better because you're using it for banking and other purposes, which is why I will check with. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. You can see here the um, issue I was having with uh, a, a genuine issue. Was that message again about the, um, the error? Go to assist. The old scammer trying again, but um, doesn't work. He's already connected. I don't know why he needs two connections. Subscribe and mobile button. Well, yeah, there is a problem. Let's get back. Not an issue. Let me just check what can be done. Okay, you can notice here, uh, he's going to pick up on the team viewer, and I'm going to blame it on a, uh, a refund scammer. Who downloaded this in your computer? Um, that was um, the nice young gentleman. He he did a thing, um, what was it, a, a, a refund of my um, the services. Firstly, sir, this is used for human hacking activities. Human hacking? Computer oh. hacking activities, you can oh, say. Computer like hacking. your information. Downloading your information without oh. your consent. Taking out your information, monitoring your information. Who put this in? Uh, it, it was um, um, an Indian gentleman. He, he was on the phone. He said that um, I, I could get a refund. Nobody refunds the amount, sir. That was a scam which was we were trying to take out your information. Oh, oh dear. Um. Did you provide them any kind of information? Uh, well, I, I had to provide them with um, um, my bank details. So that they could transfer the money. 
Nobody can transfer the money. Did you pay them anything? See, you're receiving these alerts because of the problem which you have. Oh, right. I, I, I didn't know about that. They, they said they wanted f for me to log into my bank so um, uh, they could... No, no never again the money. log into your, any bank. Okay, check okay. whether your amount is safe or not first. If you want to check it, check it first. Because if you provide them the information, you might be in trouble. If you want to check, please check it for yourself. Uh -huh. Whether your bank details... I, I wonder why check my it, bank phoned ahead. me up um, last week. They said there was some kind of activity. My bank, they, they phoned me up saying that there was some kind of activity. So I, I did pop down there, but... Um, I, I, Sir, popping I down confused. is something different. Before you pop down, check the... Well, I, I popped I will down there last scan. week. They, they phoned me up no about problem. I'll run the details. No problem. I will run a few scans in the computer just to check what is the, how they got into the device and what is the exact problem you have. There is a security breach, which means they have put some kind of an infection in the computer. Oh. Please give me a minute. Ah, uh, right, so, uh, the old variant of the tree, this one is the DIR command with, um, slash A, slash, uh, a whole load of slashes. I think slash S is in there as well. Just to show up all kinds of um, information that don't mean a thing. It doesn't mean a virus, it doesn't mean a hacking. But they're more or less trying to blame it on uh, some previous refund scammers. I think it's the only time these scammers have been truthful. Why do my eyes keep shutting? So as the scans are running, uh, I would be just, uh, I would request you to kindly wait for some time because this will take a longer time than usual. Oh, okay. No, okay. I'm sorry, I was not able to hear you. No, uh, yes, I, I was um, uh, okay with, uh, okay with that, yeah. Okay. So you, uh, are you from out of state, I guess? Are you from... Uh, well, I, 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 used, been... I used to live in Britain, you see, then I came over to America. Okay, my auntie stays in London. Oh, right, London. Uh, what part of London? Frankly speaking, I do not know which part of London, London she stays uh. in. Her name is Anastasia Bailey. All right. She's uh, one of my uncle who works for an automobile company there. I don't know, I do not know the name. They are far, uh, basically you can say far off cousins. So I'm running the scans just to check what is the problem, okay? Okay. So if we find any kind of an issue, we'll let you know. And for sure, I would just let you know that you need to get yourself a security, which will stop these kind of people from getting into your computer. And another thing which I would be giving you a certain ID which you need to make a note and once anybody tries to call you you need to ask for that particular ID if they go ahead and authentify that ID then go ahead with the call or else disconnect it okay okay in that way you will always be secured not providing any of your personal information to any random people right Okay. So let the scan complete. In the meantime, uh, may I place this call on hold for a minute, please? Okay, yes. You can get a glass of water or a cup of coffee by time. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll do that. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm just going to speed this part up because... Um, it's just me being on hold, then playing the hold music. Obviously, I've muted it for content ID purposes, but, um, did you notice that with the old, uh, doobly-doo? They had to open up two instances of this DIR command, which, of course, is just for directories. It's, um, scam tactic. So, 
so I've uh, yes I'm just speeding this up uh, I think I got it running at four times the speed if you uh, enjoy this uh, format of the premieres remember remember to like and do all that good stuff lovely should be done in a couple of seconds and then we find out uh, how many hackers and Trojans and all that rubbish that they uh, claim for me to have. Thank you very much for staying online. Okay. Sir, we found out way too much infections in the computer which they have put in. If you can look into the computer screen, this is called the event viewer. If I explain you in layman language, event viewer is known as the brain of the computer. Oh, is that like the um, uh, CPU, I think they call it? No, this is the network infection. This infection basically has been put up to monitor or gain access to your information. If you oh. can see and in, look into the computer, there are several warnings which are, which we have found and alerts or errors uh, or critical events. Yes, I see them. I hope you can see them. Yes. You cannot delete them because they are not delete. We will not be able to delete them because they have already tried to gain access to all of your information. You see it says information, information. Oh, yes. This might be your personal information, banking information, any one of them. Okay. They were successfully connected to you which says audit success. Oh, over here. I hope you can see that. Yes, it's got a little key next to it. Is that a little key? Yeah. Right. Yeah. So these are the successful attempts which they have already got into your computer and if I look into the computer part and see how many of them are connected to you now okay. without your knowledge there are 30 there are three of them who are right now connected to you well, three of them oh dear. and these are the foreign addresses which are established into the computer part uh -huh. yes. So, and the name of the infection which I found out over here, you can okay. look into the computer screen. Yes. These are more infections which we found, it's 139, to control your computer, to maintain their logs, to maintain your information. They have used a file name which is known as 1DLL32. Uh, run D. Okay. Okay, this file basically helps in downloading or monitoring information. These are, uh, I will just provide you that information. You can make a note of it. Okay, the give me a minute. File. How old is this computer? Uh, about um, six or seven years now. So, but not a new one. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so if you can look into the computer screen, this is the name of the infection, the meaning of it. You can read it out. Uh, and if you yes. find any, if you have any questions and query, you can ask. Uh, yes, so run these uh, process registered as a backdoor vulnerability, um, which may be installed malicious by the attacker. Oh dear. Um, uh, computer remote locations, stealing password, internet banking. Is, okay. Right. That's and once you're done reading it out, if you have any questions which you want to ask me, you can surely go ahead and ask. Okay, so, so is, is this Rundi, uh, is this from um, those refund people? Most probably, sir. I do not have an idea about it, but that uh, might be a problem. They might have put in this infection to monitor, gain access to your computer. And while they were trying to do that, then you have received the alert. And these uh, things... Okay, so that is why you're facing these kind of an issue. So what I would be doing, I would be running few scans just to check what they try to gain access to the computer. Okay. And accordingly, I would be able to help you out. All right. 
Yeah. Give me one minute of your time. Let me just go ahead and check that out for you. Uh, now this advanced password manager, this was a little bit tasty. Because um, my host computer kept blocking it. Uh, malware bytes would pop up saying... Oh, hold on. I guess nothing is opening in the computer. <laughs> Yeah, no, it was open because the malware bytes I, I didn't know right. Uh, because I, I, I think this uh, software is actually a key logger. Give me a minute. Okay. Your browser is out of date, okay. Ah, uh, yeah, he, he tried opening it with... Let um, me try doing it in a different browser. And with see. Internet Explorer, of course, that's out of date. Okay. Gotta be very careful with um, the websites that these scammers go to. Okay, that. Okay. Give me a minute. Okay. There we go. Yeah, let this be a lesson to uh, make sure you always have updated uh, antivirus and whatnot. Because if this was a uh, real computer without up to date antivirus, it would be a little bit tasty, wouldn't it? He, he would have um, keylogged us. But now he's gone into MS Info 32 because I believe he has noticed um, Virtual Box down in the corner. He was having a right old look at that. And looking at MS Info 32 because I haven't hidden uh, the Virtual Box details, I think he's noticed it's a VM. So let's see if he uh, tries to continue the scam or calls me out for uh, having a virtual machine. Who knows? Who knows? It's time to find out, guys. Let's have a look. Any second now, we should come back to the phone. Okay, sir. These are the <coughs> securities which you can buy. You can get it for one year of security, or three years, or five years, which I can recommend you. Five. Which you can get and get these problems fixed. Okay. Yes. One year would charge you somewhere around <coughs> one ninety nine. Three years will charge you somewhere around three ninety nine. Five years will charge you around four ninety nine. And if you want it for lifetime, you can take it for lifetime. That is for six eighty nine. Six eighty nine. Right. But I I could get a, another computer. That'd be cheaper. Yes, but there is an infection which is there in your network, not in the computer part. Oh, it's, it's on the network, it's not on the computer. Right. 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 Uh, was it because of that um, a website you wanted to go and, and it blocked it? Which website? Uh, the password website, yes. Uh, that might be a problem, I do not know, that's the reason. Well, that's because it, it's a malicious it. website, isn't it? I'm sorry? It pops up on my antivirus. Where is the antivirus? Show me the antivirus. Uh, I, I've hidden it. Every, every time it, it popped up it. and said it's been blocked by the PUP. Okay, so you can let me know. Is it, you want so any you're, kind you're of not security? trustworthy, are you? I'm sorry? You're not trustworthy, are you? You're not. You're, you're trying to scam. 
Hey, just, I know that from the beginning that you are just you making a fool out of me. me. Okay, so stop Wait, going no. ahead and no, wasting your time and my time. Okay, Bento. that's the reason I'm letting you know. You're so stop wasting your time and my I'm time. Not time is very time. precious. I'm not wasting your time. Okay. I, I will be I will be showing this to to the people. Letting them know. Sure, that you can scared. go ahead and show that. Go ahead and show that. I do not have a problem. Okay, so I've got your permission to Thank you. upload. Go ahead. What do we want to show? Show me. I'm I'm not going to show you. I'm going to show the people that you're a scam. <laughs> you can surely go ahead and do and that. And that the website was scam. All right. Go ahead. Not and a problem. You're Terry Mackichut. Bo se dikhe phone rakni chhe. You bought a CK, Randy Kabachi. Abey bo. बोसरी के नहीं बोसरी के फोन काट बहन के लंड मार तो गाने में दे दूँगा समझा लग जाए फोन अब शांति टेरी मैकिचुट एंड नई फ़ंग अप बट इट्स स्टिल कनेक्टेड बट हे हो टाइम टू डिसकनेक्ट हम टर्न ऑफ़ द वीएम एंड ऑल दैट गुड स्टफ या जस्ट लेट यू नो दैट द वेबसाइट दैट दे वर गोइंग टू द the website for the um, password. If I can bring it up on the history or whatnot. Uh, what was it? Advan yeah, advanced password manager. That was uh, kept on being blocked by my uh, malware bytes. Kept on popping up with a PUP blocked for fraud. So, uh, yeah. Of course, that was appearing on my host, not on the VM. But hey ho, it's uh, it's all good. I think that's uh, this this little part of the premiere wrapped up. Back to you guys in the old studio over there. Ah, thanks for that, silly me saying thanks to myself. Um, I think it's just about time to wrap this stuff up now. While uh, be seeing you guys on the old stream on Tuesday and Thursday and all that good stuff. So, uh, yeah. It's a goodbye from me. And it's a good bait from him. Goodbye, goodbye everyone. Yeah, you're uploading on YouTube. I know that you're uploading on YouTube, right? You can tell me your channel so that I can subscribe it, okay? Let me subscribe it and let me give you a good comment. Give me your channel. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna subscribe your channel. I thought that I can watch every day, right?